Dear Swissies and Switzerland lovers, we have spring-like temperatures in Switzerland, but it's the sport vacations and during the sports vacations everyone goes to the Swiss mountains. As it's too busy for us there at the moment, we're taking the opportunity to show you another corner of Switzerland. So we're going from the Bernays Oberland to Bölele in the Bernays Jura. Well, sometimes the plans doesn't work out. We are right now here at the hotel we booked and um, unfortunately, dogs are not allowed. Even though it was written at, at booking that dogs are allowed. So um, we need to change uh, our plans. Um, I will have a look for another hotel uh, around uh, in this area. And then I hope that we can do the things we wanted to do. Yeah, so short or sit on Yeah. Normally, I ask in the hotels if dogs are allowed, even though it is written at booking.com that dogs are allowed, but only once I didn't ask and yeah, you yeah, know, so um, the woman at the hotel told us that she will um, cancel our uh, booked room without any fees and uh, at the same time i was looking for a um, hotel nearby now we go to saint Ur urzan <laughs> and um, yeah there we find uh, where we find a hotel where dogs are allowed and i uh, i contact the hotel manager if uh, if it's really like this that dogs are allowed and yes so uh, we're looking forward to go now to the to the next hotel <laughs> and hope that uh, we are all welcome yeah yeah sometimes shit happens <laughs> Well, you know, I always say there is always a reason why something happens, yeah? And I remember one of you, or on Facebook or wherever, wherever um, asked me to visit the village saint Urzan because the village should be very nice, you know? So, voila, that's maybe the reason why this happened, huh? So now we enter to a place we wanted to visit. Uh, this place is called Gorge du Pijou. Yeah, uh, I am not sure if we just uh, drive through and uh, visit later or uh, visiting now. Yeah, I will decide in a few minutes. Mm -hmm. In this uh, Gorge Canyon, um, there's a lot of moss yeah, it's very wild and especially when it rained a lot, yeah, it's very, very special. Jurassic Park. Yay! But no dinosaurs here. Hopefully. <laughs> you never know.
Well, it's been years since uh, our last visit here, but I am still loving this area. We will visit the, the Gorge later. Huh? First we check in. Okay, now we are here in uh, Sainte Urzanne. <laughs> and now we're searching for our hotel and we hope that uh, <laughs> that we are welcome. Yeah, this time. Oh, that's a nice village, look at all. Huh? something happens. Huh? So where is our hotel? Hotel de Boeuf, which is near No Boeuf? What the is it? Ah, Peanut. Yeah, I have to. Ah, I can walk with empty, huh? And then I have to go back again. Uh -huh. And we saw the whole village. <laughs> Almost. Ah, but it's a nice village. I'm looking forward to show you the this village. We drive one one time through. <laughs> so and then we go back. to come to Saint Urzan, eh? Yeah, thank you. The normal day park plans, eh? We take this park from, I don't know. We are now in the, in the hotel. Yeah, it's whoops. <laughs> no, it's not whoops. It's Hotel Pinot. Something like that. Ah, our room. Ooh, dark side of Saint Ursand. Voilà. <laughs> hey, so cool. Was i omina, i nomina paratus. Okay. Um, it's written that the hotel is very uh, funny for funny people <laughs> and funny dogs, girl. Ah, it's really special. I love it. Yeah. I really love it. It's super. No view, ah, but it's super. I know some of you will be very happy that I do village stuff, girl. <laughs> and not always uh, these boring, beautiful hikes. <laughs> Yeah, it seems that uh, they have a lot of humor, the people living here. <laughs> yeah, so funny, huh?
Saint Urzen is a very, very old village, and um, yeah, it's uh, I think 600 after death of Jesus. Yeah, it's very, very old. So that's why all the houses look uh, kind of rustical. <laughs> yeah, but a very lovely village. Yeah, I show you more. Yeah, very historical village, huh? Uh, I, I try to tell you more, yeah, yeah, but I need to read something else, uh, to read something first. <laughs> yeah. Ah, this is the 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 holy, <laughs> the holy Saint Urzen. Yeah, uh, he once uh, lived in a in a cave, in a cave, holy, yeah, cave. Uh, maybe this one up there. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. Many, 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 many years ago, um, I think 600 after death of Jesus, something like that. And this bear, the legend tells, um, this bear um, brought him Grütli, um, herbs, <laughs> herbs daily. Yeah, and um, that's the legend of the holy Sankt Ur Ur Urzen. <laughs> yeah, the story is probably uh, bigger, but uh, yeah. This is uh, how I tell it to you. <laughs> I look down on Grütli. These are the herbs, probably. Huh? Xesh? Sally? By the way, it is part of the Grand Tour Switzerland. Yeah, just to let you know. Yeah. Das wieder. Ist das wieder? Ist das St. Ursen? Der Jean. Jean. Nepomusin. Oder so. Ah, that's another one, huh? But also holy. I'm quite sure that this village is visited by many, many people in summer. Yeah, because it's so beautiful, of course.
we go now up to the place where the holy Saint Urban, uh, Ursen, Ursen lived. Yeah, many stairs. Fitness. I'm breathing like a horse. <laughs> nice view from above. Huh, again. So that must have been the home of uh, Mr. Sankt Urzen, the Holy One. Oh, you look so sad. Hey. Yeah, keep on smiling, okay? Focus on the good. The cancellation of the other hotel really had a reason. Otherwise, we probably wouldn't have discovered this village so quickly. And as promised, we now drive to the small gorge, the Gorge du Pijou, so that Rasta can also get his money's worth. So, finally, Rasta part. Yeah, we are at the beginning of this uh, little canyon called Gorge du Pijou. Yeah, where um, there is a lot of moss, as you already can see, maybe. Yeah, where Rasta is peeing soon. Or maybe doing a, a bigger business. He don't know yet. Ah, not yet. Not yet. <laughs> Many years ago, when I had uh, photo shoots outside, um, I made an appointment with a model and this model was also a gardener and she made a dress out of moss. Yeah, that took many, many months until they, uh, the dress was finished. And then we made very, very nice pictures. Look at them.
Wake up! <laughs> Unfortunately, the dream is already over, but it's not so bad because we're heading back to the Bernese Oberland, where it's also very beautiful, isn't it? I hope you enjoyed this video and maybe you'll visit this place soon. Let me know, okay?